Ghost and Molly McGee. Hi, Bessie. So what'd you do this weekend, Molly? Oh, Libby, I had the craziest Friday night. Woo! We? Oh, no, 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 you can't tell Libby about our ghost adventures. Um, yeah, this weekend it was crazy. Uh, because Mom yes. had been looking for this scented rainbow ribbon candle, yes. which she is just nuts for. And so we just went all around town mm -hmm. looking for it. You know, we looked in... Tell her where you went. ...in uh, yes. Brighton. But more... And then Perfect Fork. Further. And then Mew Line. Yes. And then, uh... The one with the big pop onion. Okanaha. Yeah. Nailed it. And? <laughs> no rainbow candle! <laughs> <laughs> that is... crazy. Mm. I give that lie a 7 out of 10. Weird enough to be true, but boring enough that there are no follow-up questions. Good job. Oh, sweet baby corn. Oh, I hate lying to Libby. She's my best friend, Scratch. She should know about you. I'm getting stress hives from all the lies. Ah! Molly, don't you see? The more people who know about me, the less scary I am. Ugh. And I'll just be some kind of friendly ghost. But I like friendly ghosts. Well, the ghost council's at him. I don't keep my scares up, they'll send me to the flow of male phantoms! Now, do you have any edge pieces? Flow of failed phantoms? Hi, Mrs. McGee. No wonder you had trouble finding this Abe and Allie at the candle store. Uh -huh. They said they've never even heard of a rainbow ribbon candle. <gasps> so here, I made you one myself. Thanks, I guess. Just one question. Why? Why, Libby, how thoughtful of you to make us a candle from scratch. Oh, right. Mmm, smells like rainbows? Well, you've saved the day yet again, Libby. See you later. <sighs> Hmm, Molly is hiding something. Looks like the Bloodhound of Truth will have to sniff it out. Oh! Oh, 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 oh! What do I do? Should I tell her the truth? Tell her what now? Should I just avoid her? That would destroy her. Sure, that'll do. Bonus points. I'll be unhappy, whichever choice I choose. It's a lose-lose. Yeah, tough break. Anyway, I was thinking tomorrow... But she's there. loving and she's thoughtful. I can't bear to see her go. Aw, maybe it's best if I send her a text. Scratch! Get away from that phone! I don't want to lose her. I don't want to hurt her. Molly, don't you see? Nobody wants to hurt her, but better her than me. I just can't throw away a best friend. I refuse. But I don't know what to do. It's a lose-lose. But that means Libby and I can never truly be best friends. Then it sounds like Libby needs a new best friend. Good night.